。野球しようぜ。オッケー。行こう行こう。お前ら今日はやったよ。任せとけ。せ、せがと三四郎。セガタンシロー高速ハリネズミソニックのレースゲームソニック R セガサタン「みんなの笑顔に会いたい」「大和実業グループ」鮮明画像の東芝ビュースター番組予約も簡単なワンタッチタイマー採用そして魅力の10万6000円ビデオがぐーんと身近になりましたウルトラマンありがとう東芝ビデオ4月1日新発売So he's cutting my class again for another one of his stupid treasure hunts, huh? Let's go! Mark, what, 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 what are you doing here? <laughs> what do you mean, what am I doing here? This is our class field trip, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, hold this a sec. Hey, you come back here! Hi, you! Hey, hey, look at this! There's a great treasure inside this shrine! <laughs> <laughs> Listen to me! According to this booklet and this treasure magazine, <laughs> it's in this shrine! There's a secret door to the magnificent treasure of ancient s a r a m a n d a r a Very well done, Miss Mizuki. Hey, Gramps, heads up.、Hmm? Ah! Idiot, come on, help me here. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Watch me, watch your head, heads up. I'm sorry. Go. Oh, Mizuki? Just play along with me on this one, okay? <laughs> Thanks, sis. Go. Go. p r i e s t e s s teach him never to interfere with my shrine again. Teach him, do you hear me? Never again. How do you do that? <laughs> Thanks a lot, Mizuki. No, no. No, wait. Huh? <laughs> I knew that. What? As you might have noticed. 
breakfast, I always have a paraglider handy! <laughs> Danger comes with any adventure. Take a moment to breathe and relax. <laughs> I feel it very strongly. You were sent here to await my arrival, were you not? I am called Rain. My name is Rain Chipani Chorus. A taxi runs in my tummy, delivering sheets with that look. This weed is cooked round and chewy. On a hungry lake sometimes, okie dokie. Um, do you understand my words? A monkey sock, looking back occasionally and rest. Scallion? <laughs> Beef scallion? <laughs> Is something wrong? Can't you fly? My socks are falling off, Alphine! Hey, go! What? Go? What the hell are you doing? I'm falling! What does it look like? I can see that! You need a hand? Yes! Okay! Mode on! Activate rescue arms! Ooh, I gotcha! <gasps> Do you believe this guy? <sighs> Dummy. Captain, our instruments detect an anomaly in District D. There appears to be a spatial gap in the northwest area of the operations center. And without authorization, the fire department's special task force has interfered. And 18 seconds after this disturbance, they brought in their own Senju robot to investigate. That is what I'd expect them to do. No surprise. I'll report it to the president immediately. Yog Sothothia Shub Nigra. Cthulhu as a Nyarlathotep Dunwich. Apparently you're aware of the data, sir, and you'll report it to the president? Very good, sir. And you'll probably want me to file an official complaint with the fire department, along with a petition for a reasonable fine, considering it was an unauthorized operation? Gotcha, Bagoose! Seems like it was just a coincidence, but it feels like it was fated to happen. Where the hidden treasure of Sarmandar sleeps, there is a passage to another dimension, and this city and the elf world is connected. This proves that the door to the treasure exists, as I theorized. The only surprise was the connection with an elf, which is my biggest and only oversight. It makes me laugh. <laughs> How strange is this? I'm hanging off the side of the building, and an elf appears in front of me, naked, no clothes. Well, to keep a long story short, the accurate guide to the treasure was not the magazine, but the scriptures of Tazerai! It's Tazerai! Hey, you big dummy! Look! This is it! What? These are the scriptures of Tazarai! Read it, Mari, come on, look right there, read it! Okay, okay! A long, long time ago, a tiny person fell from the sky above Kurikama Village. What is this stuff? Go! 
now! Well, keep going, keep going! Uh, the little person was called the One Inch Priest and dug the treasure mountain. What? What the heck is this? Don't you get it? No. Mari, look, what it's saying is the key to the hidden treasure is the elf. It's in the book! Uh-uh, no it doesn't. This book says it's all about the One Inch Priest, you big dummy. But it's the same thing, dummy! It's not, and I'm not a dummy! Oh, I can't argue with an amateur. I'm telling you this book was written way back in the Comic Horror era! Back then, people called elves One Inch Priest, Mari! Uh-uh. There is no doubt in my mind. You're crazy. Phew. Hmm? Oh, sorry, Elfie. I forgot all about you. Wow! You look great in that outfit. Can you take me now? Can you take me to the ancient hidden treasure? Please? Oh, all of my hard work is finally gonna pay off! My beautiful little Elfie, it's fate, I tell ya! Dad, Mom, I bet you've discovered some great artifact in Europe by now. And to tell you the truth, I'm onto something really big here myself. But I just want to take a moment to thank you for everything you taught me from survival skills and ancient civilizations. But most importantly, patience! And you know, I've actually turned out to be a pretty sane guy. I'll bet I'm really the reincarnation of some famous legendary warrior! Go. Wait a minute. That would mean I'm not a human being. Go. Maybe I was raised by aliens. Hey, go! Huh? What about the nymph? What nymph? Yeah, well, it says right here in the book that the boy who met the one-inch priest also encountered a nymph who controlled a dragon. A nymph who controlled a dragon? The disgraced huh? owl. Thanks for the taxi and tea. The caterpillar dropped from the stool. I've come here in search of a sacred treasure. I seek the four hearts, which is the great symbol whose power protects our land. I was guided by the ancient legend that's been passed down through the royal family. Following it, I was led to this land. I had been told by my master that when I arrived here, I would be greeted by clever servants who would be able to assist me on my quest. I feel it. There is a great power here, and I know that you are a part of it too. Now I know the four hearts are somewhere in this land and we can find them. You must have faith in what I'm telling you. And the ancient legend says... It's still soaking in the dress from yesterday and... Mushy, mushy. I guess we really do have a language barrier. I got it! The nymph who controls the dragon! Salamander! The fire dragon! It's not Saramandara, it's Salamander! And the nymph controls it, so that priest is the nymph! I'm telling you, I knew it right from the start! Let's go, Elfie! Send me some money? <laughs> go, wait for me! Please, go! I can't believe you left me behind again! And what's with all this Elfie stuff and this team? We're the team! It's you and me! Hmm. I'm the one who's always played your little treasure hunt games ever since we were kids, and not just because we were neighbors. Uh, excuse me, lady. You never used to leave me behind. It was always you and me, Go. But now that you've found that stupid elf, lady, you don't think you need me, but you really do. Hey, you lady! Would you shut up already? Oh, well, I'm sorry if I startled you. <laughs> hey, let me ask you a question. Did you happen to see a little blonde elf somewhere today? See, we're similar in size, but I, of course, am far more attractive, and I was just... Gotcha! Are you an elf, too? I can understand you. How come you were floating? And who is that elf with goat? What did you come to me for? Who sent you? What's gonna happen to me and go? Why are you wearing those clothes? Hmm. Good afternoon, Madam Mari, and welcome home. Would you like me to prepare some dinner for you? No! Sni, mali fact, you know, ti malis pushka la ect, ma noti. Blim, na dak nezotor wam mo memo gaz gazo rib nero. Mr. Darko, listen to me. I understand you just fine, but could you put your report in writing? Takis? You heard me. I know that the fire department has made a mess of things again. I'm worried too, of course. Just put your report in writing. Don't rush. Take your time. And duly noted that trespassing during the project is strictly prohibited. Any violations may lead to probation status. Cordially, the Yamenakata Foundation! Ah! I have never heard of such a load of a Calm down, Ms. Matsuki. 
it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Who is it that's out there risking their butt every day, huh? Me, that's who, so. I'm on routine patrol when my surveillance system detects this spatial gap over their precious no-fly zone. Hey, I'm on your side. That blankety-blank, you manicotta. How dare they say I was trespassing on their property? Chill out, sweetie. And to top it off, now the bastards say their own boys will respond to any and all emergencies on their property and we're to remain your in a wand. What's <laughs> going on? losing all my jurisdiction. This Humanicata project is taking over the entire city. Well, not necessarily. What, do you know what's going on, boss? It seems to me I did recently receive a notice from the Ministry of Development. And what? Well, all I can say is it sounds like a fabulous plan. Oh, that's it? Mm-hmm, that's it. Oh, that's it! Girlfriend. What, sir? The fire department is not a bunch of muscular morons. The important thing is these big brutes protect the city and its citizens, right? After all, we do have our own way of, how shall I say, monitoring outrageous corporate activity. Hey, so does that mean they approve the investigation team? Bingo! This is the permission. Yes! Please, boss, please, you've got to uh, let me be in charge. Oh. I can do it. I'm the man you want. Please, please. Well, I... Oh, come on. Yes, yes, pretty please. Say oh. yes. Just do it. Oh, fine. Thank you, sir. Oh, dear. Did I just say yes? Hey, Elfie, I just know we're getting really close to that hidden treasure. I can feel it in my bones. <laughs> oh, here we go. Yes. <laughs> Hello? Are you okay? Hey, wake up! Oh, what do I do if she's dead? Hmm. Hmm. Boaz Mark score van den min yo pam lim na. Oh! Oh! Hey! Hey! Ah! I'm fine! Oh! Oh! I'm sorry, Mr. Takuma. I didn't see you. My fault. Entirely. Mari, my sweet, I love you. <laughs> Master Zinshuen, dinner is presently being served. Dubsock. Where's my Harkin? What? This thing? Give me that! Now this makes me sick. Light and darkness combine! Hear me and obey! Oh wow! You're like a witch or something! I am a witch, dingbat! You are a witch! My name is Mario Minakata. Oh, Mari, huh? I'm Lean Kiyami Kunyo. Suppose you could just call me Lean. Okay, Lean! Look, are you an this elf is the too? story. Oh, boy, I've come all the way from my dear home, Kenyora, by tearing really the vortex in the very fabric of space itself in order to find the elf princess ring. Isn't really you know, they really incredible? Maybe you and I could go look for a very own treasure too, huh? Well, that would be really fun, don't you think? Huh? Salamander's treasure must be hidden in this shrine, but the only problem is finding the door. According to the scriptures of Tazarai, it's you. You are the only key to this door. I'm really counting on you, Elfie. You can't let me down. You just can't. Huh? Come on, Elfie. You can do it. Just give me one hint. Okay, well, how about this? Waiting for rain, waste padding, pretty alligators, stolen pond, sweet bean bread, broken hills with mittens on, and come on, Elfie. This young man is trying to show me the way. I can feel a strong power guiding me to the Four Hearts. I feel a great power. Uh, uh, you, you, you're glowing, Elfie! Within the heart of one of the giants that you will encounter while in this land. Huh? Within the heart of one of the giants that you will encounter while in this land. Well, what do you mean? It's an old saying from my homeland, Panyora. Yes! I can understand you perfectly, Elfie! <gasps> What's going on? I've never experienced anything like this. You've got a nice voice. It's beautiful, Elfie. Who is Elfie? My name is Rain. My name is Rain Chipani Chorus. It's Rain? Rain, huh? I'm Go Takarada. You're Go? Yeah. Oh, please say it again, Rain. What you said before, just one more time for me. Within the heart of one of the giants that you will encounter in this land. A large stone, not in people's eyes, huh? Hmm, a 
large stone not in people's eyes. A large stone. Um, not in that's eyes. not exactly how it goes. I got it! <gasps> I knew it had something to do with this. Ha ha! A large stone. This is it. It needs to be exposed to people's eyes. We've got to move it. Right here. This is perfect. You can see this spot in the garden from anywhere. Right, Alfie? Come in, base. This is Red Rabbit. We've breached the perimeter and awaiting instructions. Roger that, Red Rabbit. Remain in the west quadrant and long-tailed rooster continue to proceed eastward. Yes, ma'am. Buckle down, boys, and uncover the game plan. Roger. Mm. Chief. Huh? Mm -hmm. Security has detected unauthorized personnel in District D. Altogether, there's, well, uh, well, a lot, but they're admitting some sort of communication signal. It must be the fire department's investigation team. They have no jurisdiction. Hmm, yes, uh, very nice. Uh, uh, well done, Mr. Takama. Using examples from ancient ruins as well as feng shui in presenting this high-tech project portrays the work of a genius. And I really like these smiley face stickers in the corner. Thank you. So what you're saying is uh, that the spatial gap could cause a massive shift in the tectonic layers of District D and interfere with the Salamander Project. Uh, is that what your concern is, Mr. Takama? Modiclock Noba. Modiclock Noba? Modiclock Noba. Captain, it seems the fire department is once again encroaching in District D. Eric Zahn, Shagati Point. Tatler Toplo Rong Pro Mele Uma Obra. Well, sir, with the salamander in District D, and because of the disturbance this morning, I thought that maybe we could shake them up a bit. Salamander no deck no sotor. Flam randi pokapak, mesnifa? Yes, that's a brilliant idea, my captain. Ni wan so mek flobeka. Thank you. Gotcha, Bagus. Do regatro mel nebone ni wan. Grimero mak entertainment escher frezetta wheelin. Hmm. Order the mountain salamander unit to District D. Personnel, stand by with presentation level 7. Our target is the fire department. Gotcha, Magoose! Gotcha, Magoose! Uh, yeah, yeah. That's it. Careful. Ah, oh, you're such a good stone. Hey, Yelfi, I know this might seem like a really boring adventure to you, but I'm just getting really excited just thinking about how close we're getting to the hidden treasures of Salamander. How about going down? <laughs> Good work. Mm, what's that? You may leave now, Miss Mizuki. But I don't have to if you still need me, sir. So you're staying? That is, if you don't mind me going into overtime. Fine. Down, do, down, do, down, do, down, H-I-J-K, I'm an old. This is the first time anyone has seen this room. It's part of the Umenokata Foundation City Amusement Plan. The Umenokata Foundation's a park? That's the city's project? Yes, actually it's a totally outrageous plan to turn the entire city into an amusement park. <laughs> this is one of the chosen areas of the theme park. I suppose the system will be activated when the president decides he wants to play. Activated? A state-of-the-art roller coaster. The Great Salamander Mountain. Salamander? Stand by, Project Outpost. Gotcha, Bagus. Huh? Haruki? Oh, uh, Mizuki, uh, hello. What are you doing there so late? Uh, I work here. Oh, that's right. Um, Haruki, I hate to impose, but could I borrow your purple leather skirt tomorrow night? It's kind of important. Why? Where are you going? Uh, A date? But you can't have that one. But why? Well, because you won't look good in they it. Look Haruki, the same. we're twins. There! Now the large stone is exposed to people's eyes. Now something has got to happen. I know it! Right? What? Oh. What's going on? Bobo is rolling and pants are baggy with the cat. Huh? What's that? What's wrong? I've never heard anything like it, but it sounds like a wild animal. Makes sense! Activation is okay. In that area, Activate there's only raccoons presentation. as well. All of Negative the Negative bases is definitely not a open. raccoon. More like a monster. Hold your ground, boys. Don't you guys have any fun? Begin the yes, countdown. That was a trick Five. question. How's the stone? Yeah, this is 
because you're very important to me. I... I am? Alfie, I need you. Huh? Ah. Ah. Oh, it's back, that feeling. It's true. You are the clever servant sent here to guide me. Scriptures of Tazarai! No, it's a sign. It's my language. The language of Panyura. Look! Here they are! It says to the clever adventurer who will solve ancient Salamander's mystery, this is the heartstone of Salamander's treasure. Just follow the supreme guidance of Tazarai, and your long-awaited destiny shall be unveiled to you! I knew it! The stone itself is the hidden treasure! No, the stone is not the treasure. It says no winner this time look to the east. So I think that this is just a signpost. I did it! I'm not the treasure girl! You go go! Go go go! Uh -huh. Wait! Wait! Well, there is a the train! Uh -huh. Whoa! The, the treasure, treasure is rolling away! away. <laughs> 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 Fantastic. Ah! It's <gasps> gonna blow sky high. Let's get out of here. Face, the monster was a roller coaster, but it exploded. We've got fire all over the mountain. Face, do you copy? Blast that, you Minakata! This is a nasty, dangerous mess. Those incompetent fire department idiots. What have they done? Uh, What's wrong with the salamander? That's why me, not our soldier. Just look at that, Elfie. The treasure is vanishing. The Guardian Dragon protected Salamander's treasure by destroying it. All of our hard work is disappearing right before our eyes. No, I think that was just an accident. Elfie, this is just the prologue to our adventure. Our true adventure has just begun. Destiny awaits. Let's go, Elfie! It's making my body so soft. Ooh, mine too. By the way, you remember why I came here? Well, you came looking for the elf that Go has, remember? Oh, yeah. That's right. That's right! I came here to kill Rain, that bitch! I feel it, again. But it's something I can't quite explain. Something you can't explain, Elfie. Wouldn't you say that's a little vague? You have to believe me! I do believe you! I really do! Chief, we've got an intruder in zone six. But it might be another mouse. Ugh! It's that damn fire department harassing us again! Chief, I, uh, I don't think it's a mouse. What's going on on that mountain? Do we have to clean up another Yumanicata mess? 
you want to go home for noodles first? Yeah! We're going home for noodles! Yum, yum! Uh-oh. Oh, no paraglider. Oh. It's fart in a lonely room. Oh, sorry, Elfie. Can't talk right now. My love, Mari. Captain! Pardon the intrusion, but the staff has been working non-stop for three days since the salamander accident, so if you could say some encouraging words to boost morale, I think that would be appropriate. Sure. I'd be delighted to. Morning! I know, you've slept for three straight days now. I didn't know elves could snore. Hey, what the heck's this floppy thing you've put me in? They're pajamas. I made them for you. Beef scallion? Pajamas. Um, where am I? You're in my room. Your room? I thought this was Mari's room. Where's Mari? What have you done with her? Are you still asleep? Uh, excuse me, lady. Gotcha! Are you an elf, too? Ah! I see that! You're up by the really it never come up with my face itself. itself. You came looking for the elf that Go has, remember? Oh, yeah. That's right! I came here to kill Rain, that bitch! And that's what happened. Since then, you've been sleeping for almost three days. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? So now you remember? I forgot! I traveled all the way from Panyora to kill that little elf bitch, Rain! She's mine! <laughs> what the hell do you think you're doing? Where are you going? I'm going to find Rain, and when I do, I'm going to poke her ears and kick her ass so hard it'll make her teeth so shake. So why do you want to poke her ears and make her teeth shake? Well, you know, that's a... Maybe I'd better eat something first. Good idea. There's got to be. There's got to be something. Some kind of hint or anything. Anything would do. I've got to start somewhere. Uh. But this city's changed around so much. Wait a minute. I'll bet if I can log into the Yamenakata computer, I can pull down some really important clues. Atsuki here, still working late. Go, Haruki. I won't be back today. It's Mizuki. I'm going out of town, Go. It's Mom. Pick up, Go. Oh, I guess you're not there. You know, your father found a big stone by the damn you river. It seems it's a historic discovery. Not quite as good as that last time he found that pottery, and they thought that it was Egyptian, but it turned out not to be Egyptian. It was more from sort of... Everyone, Katsu Barara Niktu Koji Cesario Simpson Lanel, Belgos Pur Mushim Fir Vladlock, Meshal Lok Wim Agliv Lai Zamarim, Tetra Gramatan Balten Taranin Elisan, Card Stoker Stashe Vazawan, Lando Jakar Lanier de Lillorian. Shewan Khan Margolain Savage Renwick Little Jean Mayfair Brooks Salamander Byrne Perez Ore Buzi Ecordano Rosakis Magin Ego Ipse Custudes Custudio Red Phoenix Ba Weep Grana Weep Niniban That's right! Shama Wallace and Gromit Matt Frewer La wrapped in. Salamander Ni Blue Dragon Slain Big Barton. Ilya Kurakin Solo Green Turtle Monimi Ya So Helgramite Tur Turtle Queen. Puntang Ni White Tiger Garden Flo Become. Yobati Yeti Nessie Shonokim Mihun. Ha ha! Barlow Elaine! 
Jasume! Barsume! Matiriyatakan! Brilliant, Mr. Takuma! Beautiful, what a wonderful speech! Oh, yes, we're behind you all the way! Gachima Goose! Gachima Gachima Goose! Thank you. Thank you. Please, you're too kind. The Yamanakata New City Amusement Plan! Ha 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 ha! It looks like Papa Manzo is thinking pretty big nowadays, huh? Bloody <laughs> gee! That would be fun, but if they change the city around too much, we'll lose all the clues to the treasure that have been hidden since the ancient times of Kamakura. We'd better hurry up. Right, Alfie? Hmm? Donkey. Hmm, look at you. Tired, huh? It just amazes me how someone so little could eat so much food. Where do you put it? Well, it's not that much different than food in Panyora, really. Lean, is everybody in your country the same size as you? Oh, sure. Actually, I've heard stories that there are some legendary giant people that live in the suburban areas, but I highly doubt that any of them could be possibly as big as you are. Oh, I meant that in a good way. Tell me something. Why did you come here, Lean? Oh, that's right! I forgot again! I came here to kill that little pixie bitch, Rain! I get it. So Rain is the elf that Go took with him. Right! That's what I've been trying to tell you! Where is he? I can't. Unfortunately, Rain and Go have been missing for the last three days now. You don't know where he is? Aren't you guys dating? We're just friends. Fart french fries? I know that everyone thinks he's a little strange, but uh -huh. it's just because they don't understand him. Oh. Not like I do. He's serious, he's honest, and really smart. Really smart. My Go is a great guy. Well, he sounds like it. And I know Go better than anybody in the world. Uh-huh. And all my girlfriends agree. They do? Yeah, they do. <laughs> he's not like that stupid Nishi in my other class. Do you know what Nishi does? Oh, he's such a loser that he transplants cat hairs onto his hairless chihuahua. What? Miyuki told me all about it. Can you believe that? That's sick. Oh, oh, oh I fell asleep. <laughs> What's this? Uh-huh, I see. Uh-huh, got it. Go! So what's up with this guy? You say that he's always leaving you behind, right? Usually. Whoa! I forgot! He doesn't know how I feel about him, and today's a really special day. Okay, girlfriend, let's get out there and find this go guy and my little elf ring. No, what I mean to say is she's not my elf. I mean, I don't even have that much of an interest in her, really. You know what I mean? Madam. What? Papa Monzo is calling you. Okay. <laughs> Hello. My name is Kanishi. I am pleased to meet you. Yo, Kazuki, Yogi, Saki, what's going on, sisters? Go, get out. This is like our new album photo shoot, you idiot. Wow, that's cool. Peace, brother, we're grooving, we're the nature. That's crazy. You guys just finished a world tour and you're already doing your next album? Oh, you're in the way. Sorry, I'm just getting something I forgot. <laughs> Look, an elf, an elf, it's an elf, I'm telling you, it's an elf, I found an elf, it's all mine, I see you. You ready? Could you like hurry and stuff? Well, we lost the light. Bummer. Alright, let's see, how's it go? When the phoenix flies, you should give a flower to the gentle nymph, said the one-inch priest. That's one of the passages from the scriptures of Tazarai. That's gotta be it. Yeah, what do you think, Elfie? Does that sound right to you? I must admit it was really a shame to watch that first treasure be destroyed. Whoa! But Elfie was right. It was just a signpost to her four hearts. So the next treasure must be east. Just follow the supreme guidance of Tazarai and your long-awaited destiny shall be unveiled to you! That's gotta be it! The scriptures of Tazarai say go to the Phoenix Mountain! I'm gonna find the four hearts, I can feel it! Elfie, we're going to Phoenix Mountain! All right! <laughs> That talk was really something. He built a first-class observation bath on top of my Phoenix Mountain. He even got a fish tank. A bath? Mr. Takuma is a brilliant man, you realize. The Red Phoenix observation bath was developed and designed by Mr. Takuma at your Phoenix Hot Springs Mountain. And that's why I've decided to take the Amenakata staff here to reward them for all their hard work. 
So, Taco, I wanted you to be first in the bath since you like soaking in the hot springs. Are you happy, my dear? Well, of course I am, Papa. By the way, does anybody know what today is? Huh? Huh? Well, of course I do. Today is our work appreciation yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, Hey, Maury! Long mm -hmm. time no see, huh? Ah, shut! This is Go? What? Look, it's an elf! You wouldn't happen to have those materials to ask me to get me, would you? Today is Mari's birthday. I'm gonna tell her in my own little way that the top of Phoenix Mountain, the bath Mari's in will come out and it's called the Red Phoenix and I must say it's the smartest thing that I've thought of today. What Mari sees when she's above the trees is gonna bring her to a pretty little knees. That's right, y'all. I bought every rose in Japan just to prove to the little girl that I'm her man. Oh, yeah. This is it, my good friends. It's the message I wanted to send. Rose's all, it's her wake up call, so we can quit play Let's Pretend. Huh. Ow. I'm so cool, I'm so smart, I'm so cool, I'm so smart. <laughs> it's just a stupid story, there isn't any treasure. It's true, dummy, according to the scriptures of Tazarai. So this is that go guy, right? How many times do I have to tell you elves are one inch priests and ancient Kamakura? It's always elves and treasure in Tazarai, and I'm sick of it. Is that all you ever think about, you big dummy? Mr. Takuma. Madame Mari and guests hmm? are arriving at the Red Phoenix facility. What are you facility. talking about? What's going on here? It's all about the music that flies off. See, that's what I've been trying to tell you. Bang washi ma rek tom la fodom la. Hmm. This is going to be great. I just cannot wait. Somebody say ho! And I bet all of those explosions were because of your little elf weren't they? No, they weren't. The guardian dragon smashed hey, into the treasure. Rain? The eternal bird means a phoenix. A the there's no is? doubt in my mind. It's a phoenix. You get it? I said, where's rain? Sleeping. Oh, come on, go. Have you ever found any treasure yet? Think about it. Oh, uh, not really. Where is she? In my waist pouch. Huh? Mari, <laughs> what's the matter with you anyway? If you were around, maybe you'd know. Mari, what's the matter? What did I do? Come on, gotcha, open the door. You bitch. Great. I wish I knew it was bothering her. She's acting so crazy right now. She always used to understand and support my adventures before. Uh, what the hell is this, Linguini? Hmm? <laughs> what? Another elf! Ah! Ah, I'm lucky, super lucky, go! Super, super lucky, happy, lucky, fart, lucky, 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 lucky! Shut up! Kanishi, remove Mr. Go. Yes, madam. <laughs> Dummy. Yeah, talk to me. Madame Mari has just entered the observation hmm? lab, and she's now prepared to ah! yeah! So tell me, madam, what do you think of it, our little bath? Yes, it's heavenly! Oh, Haruki, would you stop calling me madam? After all, we've known each other since we were kids. Well, yes, we have, haven't we? Growing up, I remember how our own little tomboy, Natsuki, would treat you like a baby. <laughs> I know, but it was mostly you and Kazuki who scolded me. I'm sorry. Mari? Yes? Has Goat done something to upset you? Mm -mm. It's okay. It's not. Go is such a boy. Why don't you find someone better, more responsible than him? Huh? Better than Go? Well, what about you? Who, me? Well, I... That is, it's kind of hopeless. He's married? Of course not. If he's not married, then what's the problem? Mari, what do you think about Mr. Takuma? <gasps> Mr. Takuma? Hmm. Well, he's an authority on feng shui, Yamanakata's project chief, and my dad's right-hand man. He's cute, but not exactly my type. Anyway, why would you say it isn't meant to be if your guy's not married, Haruki? Oh, Mari, I don't exist. He's in love with another girl. Oh, I see. Hey, Mari! Hmm? Oh, what do you 
think of this? Hey, wow, Papa's here too. Any minute now, that race is gonna start, and if I don't move fast, it's gonna break my heart. I gotta get all the ropes back into place before my beautiful party does a beautiful face. Ah! Hey, Haruki, mm -hmm. this bath is a thousand square feet and has a fish tank on the bottom, right? But what about the observation part? Well, it's standing by. What? Are you ready to see the rest of it? Activate the Red Phoenix observation bath. Bath activated. Ah, oh, crap. Not now. No, no, I'm almost done, you idiots. <laughs> then we can pretty much kiss our chances of finding the four hearts goodbye, right? What? <laughs> I think we're gonna make a great team! Yeah! <laughs> ah, ah, Mari! I made it on time! What? Me? I am? We're floating! Hey, Buster, we do this all the time. You mean you don't? <gasps> Everything's so beautiful! It's amazing, Rookie! It is impressive, isn't it? I did it, Mari! Let this message in roses prove my love for you! The hell? No, not again! I almost had it! <laughs> it's flying! Oh my god, the phoenix is flying! Well, the scriptures of Tasharai say when a phoenix flies, you should give a flower to the gentle nymph, so said the one it's priest! While the phoenix is flying, so where is the gentle nymph? Where is it? Where is the nymph? I need you right now! It's important! I dream of Genie with a light brown hair! I need you, Mari! You're the gentle nymph! What exactly do you think you're doing, Go? Uh, Haruki! Hey, I'm glowing! Huh? It's okay, I can do this, I can do this! This was a good idea, this was a good idea! Yes, sir. I can make it! I think I can, I think I can, I think I can!
Yes! Made it just in time. Mr. Kakuma, please move! I can't hear you, Miss Harugi. You're breaking up. Look out! Please come in. Takamoto home base. Come in, Haruki. flies, you should give a flower to the gentle nymph, so said the one-inch priest. I now know what my true treasure is. Hmm? Go, you remember. Of course. You remembered my birthday. Birthday? It's no use. It's ruined! My beautiful message! So tell me, Rain, what are we gonna do about finding the four hearts? Within the heart of one of the giants that you will encounter in this land? Yeah, right! I know that saying. In the first giant you encounter, the first giant. So you think this giant go might have some key to finding the four hearts? Yeah. That's funny. There's nothing happening. You are watching the Sci-Fi Channel. ドロリッチベリーミックス出た今夜は満足させてくれるかい今夜こそ満足させてあげる幸せいっぱいご満いっぱいご満足新発売
Diary of Rim de la Paz, Galaxy, Era 2395, Month 3.8. It's been two days now since I stowed away on this smuggler ship bound for Planet Trace. My heart is filled with hope as we draw nearer every day. Hey boss, I'm picking up a warp impulse approaching our position rapidly. Mm, graph me out a projection of its course and distance. Right. It's approaching rapidly on an intercept vector. This is the 73,000 and... It just vanished off my scope! It vanished? Tell me, is there an uncharted hyperjump gate in the sector? No, sir. The readings are all wrong. It was there and then it wasn't. Don't be an idiot. Check your scan files. It's back! 25 clicks! It's coming straight out of subspace! Messiah's new state-of-the-art butt kickers. I take it you're pleased. <clears throat> if you trust the data sheets, this baby could carve a tattoo on your rear end from 30 clicks. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds fun. Bab, something like that's wasted in the hands of an amateur. <laughs> I'll write that on your tombstone. Oh, look at this! Dipsy, what you think? <laughs> oh, hey! No fair! I want that one! Oh, come on, Jimmy. May! May! Have you finished offloading the provisions yet? Of course, of course you think we, we are, are. Yeah. Jenny, stop playing with that gun. Aww. You've got an inventory to take. Yeah. Nag, nag, all the nag. voices I've heard are women. Right, Did I get to trace after all? Hey, at least there's something useful in this container. Take a gamut this, Feb. Catch! Hmm, nice looking blaster. Not very accurate, though. Hmm. Food, clothes, ammo, nice. 
Looks like we got a little of everything. Good work. This was an even more profitable haul than we were expecting. We ought to be set for a while then, huh? Mm. Okay, let's space the rest of this junk and blow this quadrant. Oh, oh my gosh, this isn't Trace. I must be on board the pirate ship. <gasps> hey, May, you missed that one. That's because <sighs> Bev blew the lock. No problem. <laughs> it's open now. Show. You're just jealous. I got a little of everything. How's it going, May? Oh. oh, hi, April. Got anything out of the kid yet? Not very much. What's your mm. name? Rim. What planet do you come huh? from? So why were you hiding in that smuggling canister? Mm. What a dope! That's the way it's been all morning. He just keeps saying, I want to go to Trace. It's so stupid! If this is the way boys are, I'm glad we don't have any. Mm -hmm. Creamy's just scared, right? Mm -hmm. Hey, Kit, it's not like we're the boogie women, you know. We're your friends. Hmm. He is a pain, isn't he? If you ask me, we ought to just shove him out an airlock. <gasps> you wouldn't do that, would you, even if he is a boy? That's way too cruel. Do you have any suggestions, Fab? Your call. Look, kid, if you don't talk, you'll be breathing vacuum. Now, what's so important about getting to Trace? <sighs> I'm waiting. I have to go to Trace. <clears throat> <clears throat> then where are you from? You can choke out that many syllables, can't you? Answer me! <sighs> Uno. Uno. Uno and Trace. A pair of twin planets in the F-63 mm. cluster. <laughs> By the way, do you like my dress? You're such a geek, June. Just tell us about these planets. Well, they were at war until five years ago. That's when a really bloody military coup wiped out the UNO leaders and placed Batros in firm control of both planets. Unfortunately, Emperor Batros isn't very benevolent. Mm. More UNO ones have died since the war than during. been found guilty of treason. Pamphlets were found in his house identifying him as a sympathizer with the underground movement. Kill him. <laughs> Doctor! 
Doctor! Doctor De La Paz! Huh? They've executed 23 today alone. I know. It's monstrous, discarding human beings like so much scrap metal. What about the project? From what I've been hearing, it could be ready any time now. Have we secured the container numbers? No, but it should be soon. Once we have those, we can begin the final phase. Mm, I hope so. Have faith. It won't be long now. Trace is about to eclipse the sun again. How can something so beautiful contain so much evil? This ship is not going to Trace, and we can't take you with us! Your entire future is riding on whether or not you decide to talk to us. Come on, why don't we just face the little beggar already? You are such a genetic throwback. Well, why not? Isn't that how we dispose of all the other garbage around here? Microbe brain. Ugh, come on! <laughs> 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 This is getting to be a little much. Yeah, but I figured he'd squeak if I squeezed him a little harder. Look, kid, you've got to understand, we only go where there's treasure. Treasure? Well, of course! We are space pirates, after all. We'd cross the galactic core for a nice bit of plunder. Hey, what if there was treasure on Trey? Yeah! What if there was that? Ah! You'd better not be making this up, kid. It's true, I swear. Oh, so we should just trust you then. <sighs> Are you calling me a liar? Look, kid, even if there was a treasure, we can't just go and rearrange our schedule to convenience you. Not even if it was the Gnosis? <gasps> the, the Gnosis? gnosis? <gasps> Boy, is this true? Is the Gnosis really on planet Trace? Promise to take me there and I'll tell you. Is it a deal? Are you... You're in a bad position to be negotiating from, little boy. <sighs> Have you gone crazy, Feb? What's so damn urgent all of a sudden? You mean you don't know? Haven't you ever heard about the Gnosis? Of course not. Uh, okay, June, tell me what the Gnosis is. Well, it's prehistoric. A repository for all the knowledge in the galaxy since before the Galactic Era. Go on. It's just a legend, and it may not even be real, but even if half the stories are true, then it could be the most valuable thing in the universe. It's still hard to swallow. But what if it's real? Whoever holds the Gnosis will know the secrets of creation and wield the power of a god. Hmm. Think of what we could do with the very power of the heavens behind us, April. So what's this thing doing on the planet Trace? That's a very good question. It sounds pretty tasty, though. Yeah, a chance like this comes along once in a lifetime. If it's really there, let's do it. Yeah, the pros definitely outweigh the cons. Rim, mm -hmm. you've got a deal. Mm -hmm. Projected course plan alpha. Hmm, no, a little much, I think. Let's proceed with plan beta. June, have you finished the course plots yet? You're sounding pretty wasted, Feb. We've barely got an hour until orbital insertion. Shouldn't you be getting ready now? <laughs> Here's to treasure. Those defense rings are going to be a real problem. And we'll have to cross them two times at the very minimum. Don't! May, you're bugging me. <laughs> Come on, May. It's time to go to work. Get to your station. Aye, aye. Um, there's a small flotilla of ships approaching from Sector 15. Feb? Hmm. Can you ID them, June? Working on it. I guess they couldn't have spotted us already. I rather doubt it. Not this far, anyway. Uh, it's a welcoming committee from Trace, all right. Seven heavy cruisers. Should we dive? What's our course? Uh, ten minutes until ring crossing. Mm, better safe than sorry. Go ahead and engage a subspace dive. Aye, aye, aye. What the? The enemy cruisers have a target launch on us! Not possible! Uh, April, Feb, they're shooting at us! June, shields up! They're up! Five seconds to impact! Did 
you to take Rem out in the shuttle. Janny, June, you two go with him. No way! No way! No way! No way! No way! Even for the kind of treasure we're after, the level of risk is just too great. I'll stay right here. No way, no way, no way. But without your skills, we'd be lost, June. That's right, smarty pants. You're the data hack who knows everything about the planet Trace. Come along. No! 30 seconds. Positive ID. Ready on the gravity net. Aye, sir! Accelerating to point three in five seconds. Is this some kind of trick? No, sir. It seems impossible, but somehow that ship made a jump without using a gate. It must be a completely new form of subspace technology. How interesting. Yes, sir. Anything else? Yes, Your Excellency. Just before it made the jump, the ship deployed a shuttlecraft. Hmm. Are we there? Are we really on the planet Trace? Of course we are. Come on, let's get going. Wait up! Open the door! Why are you so hyper? It's not like you can do anything on your own, you know. You little worm! You were gonna yeah. bug out as soon as we landed, weren't you? I don't see any signs that we've been detected yet. There's ten clicks of nothing between us and that treasure now, and Trey City is just a few minutes by hover buggy. This'll be a piece of cake. Jenny, break out the buggy. Aye, aye, April! <clears throat> Man, this air is dry. <laughs> How can anyone stand to live in such a desolate wasteland? I mean, really, this is going to be murder on my hair. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? <laughs> Nothing. Were those your exact words? What a vacuum hit! She shouldn't come playing with her instruments! <laughs>
May. May! Haven't you fixed those engine problems yet? What's wrong, Beth? Getting dizzy? <laughs> Turn the gravity engine back on at least. You know I get motion sickness. <laughs> You're just a big crybaby. It'll take the whole day to fix these things, and you know it. <laughs> just uh, fix it. Well, Your Majesty, our analysis shows that three of the intruders are not registered in our data files. We cannot therefore assume that they come from our sector. The boy, on the other hand, is on file. The son of Dr. Melanian Delapaz. Melanian? Tell the rebels. One false note and Melanian's son will pay the piper. Get in there, you! I am Batros, Emperor of Trace, and you are Rim. I'm moved by your courage. So moved that I have decided to grant you your fondest wish. Thus. Overcoming such odds only to find this. Oh, what's he done to her? He froze her alive. How very amusing that such an infamous group of pirates would turn out to be such lovely young women. But first, you've been preying upon my supply ships, and the penalty for that is death by slow torture. However, I may be willing to extend you three ladies a pardon if you turn your ship over to me. To me! With your jump gate technology, I could rule the galaxy. And unless you have no desire to ever see another sunset, you'd better make arrangements for your partners to surrender your ship immediately! Oh. Ah. Jenny! Oh. Ah. <clears throat> I don't think you fully understand the situation. My data hacks have determined that your ship carried a crew of five, three of whom I already have in my possession. Surely shipmates wouldn't be such fools as to take on all of Trace. I shall be lenient. Turn your ship over to me and I will guarantee your freedom. What could be fairer than that? Girls as bright and clever as yourselves could manage to find some way off planet. <laughs> and if we refuse? A simple choice. Die in the arena. Or perhaps join the lovely collection of frozen maidens in this chamber. What an attractive set of options. The answer's no. The idea of living by the grace of a pig like you makes my skin crawl. Compared to that, your so-called options are really quite appealing. At least we won't have to endure your bloated ego. Tough talk for a thief. No, not thieves. Pirates. And unlike you, we don't traffic in the sale of human pain and suffering. You want to take the soul, Bianca, you petty tyrant? You're not man enough to take her! Oh, I'm man enough. Mad enough to shut your filthy mouth! <laughs> well, that seems to have blunted your sharp little tongue. Not so strong without your ship around you, huh? Take him away! Feb! Feb! Can you hear me? Are you there? Answer me! What the hell are you two doing up there? Oh!
How? What? So where are you? Right above you, orbiting Trace. And yourselves? We've been captured, beaten, and thrown in prison. So disappointing. You think you can get out by yourselves? Oh, sure. We've just been calling you as a courtesy. Of course we need help. We're in real trouble, Feb. The guy in charge is a total nutcase, and he's gonna execute us in the morning! I got that, but the engine repairs will take at least another 12 hours, and until then, we can't even touch the main weaponry. Spare us the details! Well, I'll try to come up with something. Just stay put, okay? As opposed to what? It's not as if we're going anywhere anyway. No, this can't be happening! I'm not about to die in here! Yeah, looks like the super brain just blew a fuse. I'm the one who got all of you into this mess. It's my fault. Rem. I thought, I thought that you were just a bunch of lousy pirates and it wouldn't matter. That's why I couldn't tell you about my plans to rescue my mother. I was afraid you'd back out, if you knew. And if you didn't, I might never see her again. I should have told you everything. That's all right. And believe it or not, I do understand. I was willing to do anything to get to Trace, and I did. I said it's okay, Rem. We might have come to this planet for very different reasons, but I'll make you a solemn oath. We will rescue your mother, Rem. I swear that we will. And we're going to get that treasure, too. <laughs> don't you believe me, Rem? I don't know if I can. <laughs> Listen to me, Rem. If you believe, truly believe, in the dreams that you hold in your heart of hearts, and use your eyes to see, and your course will be swift and true. Can you believe? The pellets have been placed in a storage facility at Dock 12. How many? A total of four containers. We also have the numbers. Good. That's more than enough. With that much, we could destroy the entire city. Our other cells are ready to move immediately. Ours is the underground. Can't we at least give the rescue of the hostages a higher priority? We cannot commit to that. My condolences on your situation. That is a private matter. My son made his choice on his own initiative. However, I have to wonder if any freedom bought at the cost of so many innocent lives can be called a liberation and not a massacre. Well, that's the price we must pay. Can't we at least delay the first phase? It's impossible with Trace increasing its death grip on us every day. We have no choice. We're at the end of our ropes. If we wait any longer, we'll find ourselves hanging from them. We must attack now. Doctor, we've got to do it. He's right, Doctor. We've got to. Begin the attack at the next eclipse. program should be in sync. That's good, May. And check the weather conditions, too. Hmm. Wind's about three clicks an hour. Temperature is 25 degrees. Pressure is 0 .003. Yeah. Oh, Get back no. here! Oh. 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 Good morning, April. Were you expecting a rescue? Fab! Is the ship repaired? Well, almost. But we still can't use the main guns. So I'm going to give this new toy of Jenny's a try. Mm. This gun is designed for distance, uh, isn't it? Oh, now let's see. How do I aim this? Oh, don't be so negative. It's no problem.
nuts! I'm gonna have to circle to gain altitude! Oh. Hit the turbo jet! I'm trying! Stolen vehicle is heading south. Engage pursuit! What are you trying to do, Jenny? Circumnavigate the planet? My feet won't reach the aileron pedals! Would you like to come up and push them for me? Get up there! <laughs> There's no way I'll squeeze past your fat thighs! Just hurry up and do it! They're on our tails! <laughs> Star screams! And here we are both along in a freaking leisure boat! We've got to rescue Rem! Are you out of your freaking mind? We can't just abandon him! What? What makes you think we're gonna get out of this mess in one piece? We've got to rescue us first! What's your plan? First we find our shuttle! All power on. Engine initiate. Program engaged. That's got to be them. Shuttlecraft approaching. Hurry up and set a rendezvous course. Aye, aye. Rendezvous will be getting engaged. Welcome home, April. Send the skin of the ex-commander of the Defense Force to my trophy room! Yes, sir. Urgent message, Lord Emperor. Mm. Mm. Gavance? Yes, sir. The vermin on Uno have decided to come out of the woodwork. Mobilize all forces and initiate a state of alert. Yes, sir. Target the center of Trace City. Target trajectory set. There's no turning back now. This is it. Mm -hmm. Sir, the train carrying the Pulse will be arriving in 15 minutes. Don't let your concentration get lax on defense. Affirmative. like last time! And just what does that mean, you ape? Look, the ship's a mess, and I'm not exactly crazy about getting the crap stomped out of me again. If we go back, we could all end up... <clears throat> See? Yeah, or something worse. Being frozen in that megalomaniac's treasure room isn't how I want to spend eternity. For once, Jenny's right. Fab. Emotions make lousy tactical advisors. <sighs> the second squadron has moved into position. All units, maintain a course separation of 51 degrees. Gunnery crews, set all targeting devices on coordinates 3, 4, 8 on the UNO surface. Initiate long-range bombardment on my mark. 3, 2, 1, now!
forget the attack on Trace. We've got to use the homing weapons to stop those fleet carriers. Negative. We can't. And even if we could cancel and recalculate, we still couldn't stop them. Our best hope for victory is to continue the original attack. Mission set. Assigned targets destroyed. 80%. Adjacent and non-designated property damage estimated at approximately 38%. There'll be no liberation for those vermin. They'll die like rats in a trap! Listen to me, Rem. If you believe, truly believe, in the dreams that you hold in your heart of hearts, and use your eyes to see, and your course will be swift and true. Can you believe? I believe. Two minutes until pellet train arrival. Repeat. Two minutes until pellet train arrival. alone, are you? Traveling by yourself isn't safe. Besides, that treasure was meant for all of us. <laughs> You're all suited up. <laughs> well, we are, but there's no way we could survive a direct assault on a fleet of that size. Uh, it'd be as suicidal as sticking our faces inside a hornet's nest. But, but there's gotta be some way. There is a way, just one. Fab! Use the ship's jump capability. Take them out where they won't be looking. You call that a plan? Got a better one. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Fab. Cruiser 16 just hit Cruiser 12. What? Now number five and six have collided. Get there! Seal off all the corridors immediately!
Okay, that's got it. to settle. Come on, April, where are you guys? Uh, okay, they're two blocks ahead of our current position. Uh, hey, don't move around sorry. so much, you're tickling me! <laughs> now tell me where that scumbag you call an emperor is hiding. Hmm? Oh, crap! Uh, Marvelous plans destroyed by a single ship full of lousy pirates. It can't be. It's not happening. Why are they doing this? By the way, if you want to live, you'd better leave now. Do it, 
June. Aye, aye, Feb! Delapaz, Galaxy Era 2395, Month 3.11. I know now what I want to be. When I grow up, I'm going to be a space pirate. I'm sure my mom and dad will be a little upset, but it's something I've got to do. Well, maybe I'll just be a starship captain. That way, just maybe, I'll get to be on the crew of the Sol Bianca again. So this is what the Gnosis turned out to be? Yes. Once upon a time, a young race created this device for the purpose of gaining knowledge about the universe. It contains a message from the third world of an ancient solar system. Hmm. You mean that's all? Yeah, that's just what I was about to say, geek face. So where's that power of God stuff? Didn't I tell you that was just a rumor? Don't blame me if you got your hopes too high, you Neanderthal! Eh. Kill us, Taylor, please. <gasps> it's beautiful! It is. Mm, wow. It's a gift. A treasure from those who lived long ago. From across space and time. Images of the mother world that birthed us all. An inheritance that we can never forget.
I know you.